opposition federal lawmakers call for Namde Kanu's release. So why is federal government of Nigeria not saying anything about this? Why? If everybody can now see that releasing Mazen Namde Kanu is a done deal, so why is the federal government of Nigeria not saying anything about this? Welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for stopping by. If you're just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel and don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Please share this video, let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in Nigerian political landscape. Thank you. Members of the minority caucus drawn across various political parties in the House of Representatives on Monday adopted a motion seeking for the immediate release of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Ipop Mazen Namde Kano. The motion was sponsored by the member representing Ekono, Omar Hea North, and Omar Hea South, Federal Constituency, Honorable Obi Agwacha, which was adopted by the minority caucus during the dinner to commiserate the end of the first legislative year of the 10th Assembly. Honorable Agwacha, who made an impassioned appeal to the minority caucus, urged his colleagues to take a definitive position on the ongoing discourse surrounding Mazin Namdi Kano and he exploit a political solution to this pressing issue. He observed that the minority caucus consists of members from the following political parties, People's Democratic Party, PDP, 115 seats, the Labour Party, 35 seats, the New Nigerian People's Party, NNPP, 19 seats, All Progressive Grand Alliance, ABGA, 5 seats, Social Drama, uh, drama Democratic Party, SDP, two seats, Young Progressive Party, YPP, two seats, and the African Democratic Party, ADC, two seats, respectively. In his lead debate, Honorable Obi Agwacha emphasized the importance of a united stance within the minority caucus, highlighting that the resolution of Mazen Namdi Kanu's case is crucial for national peace, stability, and unity. He called for immediate and strategic engagement with relevant stakeholders to advocate for a peaceful and political solution to the matter, which has significant implications for the social political landscape of Nigeria. Honorable Agwacha underscored the potential benefit of addressing this situation through dialogue and reconciliation rather than a prolonged abuse of legal processes and confrontation. The lawmaker expressed optimism that a political solution could pave the way for enhanced national integra integration and the restoration of trust among various committees. Today, the opposition parties have taken a decisive stand on Mazen Namdi Kano. The planned protest, the insecurity, the dilapidated infrastructure and the economy, the abduction of the, the position on Mazen Namdi Kano by the influential uh, caucus comes off the heels of the recent visit to the former president, Muhammad Buhari. Successful mobilization of 50 of his colleagues across all parties and also the Southeast Caucus of the National Assembly. It will be recorded that the Southeast Governors Forum also joined in call for the release of Mazin Namde Kanu. Honorable Obi Agwacha, a call to action by his colleagues, serves as a reminder of the crucial role that legislative bodies play in fostering peace and stability in the nation. He remains committed to championing initiatives that promote justice, equity, and harmonious coexistence across Nigeria. 
now is now like this. The federal government of Nigeria have to do this. You understand? Because the federal lawmakers massively approves obese motion to release Nam the Kano. You understand? They have seen this that this is the only way, you know, we can experience peace in Nigeria. So why are we still here? That is the question. Why are we still here? Why are we still here? We keep on going, you know, around, 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 around. It does not make sense at all. It does not make sense. This man should be released. You understand? For peace. For peace in Nigeria. You understand? So, guys, when I don't see the matter now, uh, we are still waiting for Nigerian government, you know, to say something or do something about this Mazinam the Kanu's release. As you can see, uh, they believe that Mazinam the Kanu's release is not just about Mazinam the Kanu, it's about the unity, progress in the Southeast, and the safety of Southeasterners. Well, I'm dropping it here, guys. Let's hear from you. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you and bye for now.